what's up vlog okay this is like living a double triple life i swear i just finished filming a patreon video about my first time eating a girl out <laughs> i was talking about eating her out on blood i mean it gets crazy over there it sucks that i can't share this with you guys on youtube like it really does but i'm telling you guys like even that will get this demonetized just me saying this um and then if i actually did put the thing up it would instantly get removed and i would get a strike it would be just awful so i'm sorry it is what it is it's what it has to be it sucks if you are interested in my sex talks i'm also going to be showing my um surgery scars which is what i wanted to show on youtube for a long time i don't even think that's very sexual i think that's just more like they don't want nudity on here but i want to show the scars i think it's educational um so i'm gonna probably film that either tonight or tomorrow for patreon um but that's just my five dollar tier on there anyways enough about that i do live shows still do my vlogging today we are going to um be filming a morning routine inspired by Logan Paul. I have actually gotten into Logan Paul not even as a joke. So I try to like get into Jake Paul like as a joke, right? To like see what everyone's talking about to talk, try and make some sort of satire thing. What I'm doing today is kind of like a satire like parody thing, but I truly do love Logan Paul's vlogs. Like I think he's a lot and I think to hang around him would be super obnoxious. I don't know actually, maybe it's just a character. In my mind, I think it's just a character. I've talked to, I think I was just talking to Shane about this where even Jake Paul, I feel like I feel like I've talked about this too before. I don't know. I feel like I'm, I have so many to my live shows and my two YouTube channels and my Patreon and my Snapchat, my private Snapchat. I feel like I'm, I tweet. I feel like I'm always like, repeating myself. So I've already talked about this already. But and, and Shane made this point, so I'm giving him the credit for it because it's it's absolutely true. Like both of these guys, like Logan Paul just finished a huge film called Valley Girl, which is a remake of an '80s film. He's also been in a ton of films, uh, like movies as like the lead and stuff like that and then Jake was on a Disney show for like three years and both of that is really hard work those are long hours on sets you have to learn your lines you have to show up be dedicated like so you can't be I mean yes you can still be like a jackass in real life or obnoxious or whatever like that but you can't be an idiot and you also can't have like a terrible work ethic and if anything they have a very smart work they're very they hustle hard and I know you say oh well like going to buy Lambos and going to Italy I mean but they're putting out content people want to see they are living like extravagant luxury LA life and even someone like me who lives in LA like I'm still I still I'm like whoa like you know what I mean I wish I mean obviously I'm not their audience I'm a 30 year old bitch you know what I mean almost 30 I keep calling myself 30 I need to not age myself I'm a 29 year old bitch I'm old I'm not their audience their demographic but you know they are they're just they do immature things which is annoying but but I, I do I do get into it like when they buy cars and I don't know uh, it's interesting their houses their lifestyle what they do I mean just buying like a school bus and like <laughs> just doing crazy shit it's kind of like jackass meets the hills meets you know YouTube this new generation which I think is smart and anyway so the whole point of all that was is I'm gonna be a maverick and I'm gonna do my Logan Paul look how huge my boobs look in this shirt by the way I don't know why v-necks always make you look super bustier so if you're busty and you want to look even more busty or you're not busty you want to wear some v-necks I swear this is like whatever so I have my Logan merch my maverick merch I did buy Jake Paul merch but honestly I'm not gonna lie like Logan Paul's merch is like a lot better <laughs> just like the quality of it is better and so I know it sounds weird it looks nicer it looks more mature like I can wear this and not feel like a like a weird person like sometimes I had the tie-dyed one by Jake Paul and I almost wore it out one time even just to get my hair done when I was like a mess I can't even wear this out it just looked a little sloppy I don't know I'm low gang all the way <laughs> so that's what we're gonna go film I have a subscriber who follows me on Twitter bringing up her Pomeranian. She originally was gonna bring four. I think she's only gonna bring one or two now. I'm fine with whatever. I said I only needed one to be Kong. My sister has, she actually already has the, what are they called, Sun, Sun Conyards, Conyard Suns? I don't know. She already has like literally the same bird as Maverick. Her name's Pixie, so I'm gonna use that. So I was like, oh, it'd be cute to get a dog, and I put out to tweet if anyone had Pomeranians, and this girl had really cute ones. I guess she recently cut their hair, so she was like nervous about, she's like, I don't wanna catfish you. They don't have like the fluffy hair anymore, and I was just like, is that my mom? Oh my god, I think that was my mom. I was just talking about Patreon. About, um... <laughs> I might have to pick up my mom, I don't know. Um, so yeah, it's just gonna be like, I don't even have anything really planned. I don't even know what I'm doing. I just thought it'd be funny to have like the merge and take pics. And then I have my G-Wagon, which is like his Yeti. I mean, his Yeti is pretty sick, I'm not gonna lie. Like, it's sick. 
these kids are so young. Like sometimes when I watch, I'm like, oh my god, what am I doing? But it's you know, it, it's what's popping on YouTube, and YouTube's always changing. So I gotta see what the kids like, and so I thought it'd be fun to kind of do this like Logan Paul thing because I watched so much of him lately, and I know all his slang. So we're gonna see how that turns out. And then we hang out with my mom and my sis, and uh, yeah. So we are at the beach. Love to get the beach. It's so nice. See how that goes. You guys, just for you guys asking, oh, why didn't you get your mom and sister the owl and the alligator? Bitches, I did. Just because you don't see it doesn't mean it doesn't happen and they have it right in their house. My mom made me breakfast. <laughs> My popcorn. There's the mom over there. It was a popcorn, like I said yesterday. She lied in the Snapchat. There's my bird, my star over there. It's not my bird, it's my sister's. We just shot half of the morning routine. Now we're waiting for the pups. Thank you. You're welcome. So good. My sister's killing this. I wish this was sponsored. I know you guys think I'm probably sponsored by this app, but we love it. She's playing Hellfire and I'm like mesmerized. And mom, what are you doing over there? <laughs> and this is our Monday. <laughs> this is so fun. <laughs> So good. Where's you going? Are you ready? Wait, this is snow like John so? Yeah. You guys, look at you. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. Just a little baby. I know. Yeah. That's Noelle. I think She's Noelle's like nine. What's this one's name? Rambo. Rambo. Look at them. They are just so. Here, pop that. Not a pee. This is snow. I'm scared he's going to pee. Who? Rambo. Yeah, like in the front. I don't want him to pee in your house. <laughs> Love Actually, I'm gonna show you down. Here, we'll put you down. <laughs> Hi, what's this one's name? Bubby. Bubby, and that one is? Rambo. Rambo, Rambo yeah, Bubby, Snow. <laughs> I know, I like so cute. You guys, and this is Julie. She's, you don't wanna be on it? She's my, she's the one on, on my Twitter. She's so cute. These are all her pups. She's letting me, I literally was like, I just want one palm, and she has so many. That one's so precious. I think that one's the one we gotta use in the video. She's wild. She works at an animal hospital. Yeah. Wants to be a vet, she said. I want Noelle. Noelle! Oh, so birds are like your thing. This is very inquisitive of a pixie, Callie. That one right there. Noelle. Noelle. This is the one I think we're gonna use. This one, it was my first one I held. Look at that little face. She's so precious. This is the one that Julie kept tweet, uh, texting me and I was like, her face is so cute. She was there, they got short hair now, but they're just as cute. They're just as cute. Do you want her? Okay, I take you. We have all these dogs. No, these, you keep them so clean. You're so cute. I can't believe you don't want to be shown. I want to show you. You're literally so cute. Sure, she's so sweet. You're so funny. Your texting was so cute too. She's like, oh, thank you so much. I'm a girl, thank you. Are you kidding me? I used to like watch you when I was in high school, my old best friend. And like, I don't know, I just like looked, I don't know, this is weird. No, I saw like, you had this <laughs> done. You were so cute. I was like, literally, I looked at you thinking, I'm like, girl, you're so cute. You're so with it. I feel like the weird one asking you to no, bring up dogs like, for a video. Better. My boyfriend's like, don't text her a lot. She's gonna think you're weird. And Not, oh, are you oh, kidding me? I love it. it. You're literally my so cute. And you're like smart and you have all these dogs. I was like, oh my God, I want to. So yeah, we're shooting, we're finishing our morning routine. And now I kind of want to take them. I want to take them all in my car and like take pictures in there and like videos. Oh, that Would that be cool? cool? Okay, let's do it. I'm so excited. Look at my mom over there. She wants to keep that one. The baby girl. Oh, she's so yay. young. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I know. She like <laughs> Aw. So I know. I couldn't be cuter. I did. And they're so tiny. Yeah, Why is this one have the best? I'm like still for <laughs> Really? <laughs> I'm freaking out because there's so many dogs. I feel like I'm not a very good hostess because I just want to see all the no. dogs. I'm like, ah. That one's so okay. Okay. At the airport, you know, they're usually you're not yeah. supposed to pet the animals, and they uh -huh. have one that says, Please pet me. Oh. They're starting that at the airport, so I have them walk through oh, a dog on the way. Look at that one. It's a good idea. Oh, yeah. baby. It says, Please pet me. We're kidnapping okay. this one. We're stealing her. <laughs> <laughs> Aww. Oh my gosh. 
I honestly, this is why I love the internet. I would never have been able to meet Julie or all these dogs. I'm on my dad. Ah! <laughs> You're so funny. I'm like, can we vlog? You're like, oh, I don't care about social media or anything. She's like, she just was so sweet. She brought up all these dogs. Hi, babies. Rambo, look. Look, look. Look at the camera. Say hi. She brought all these to audition for my morning routine. I know I made it just because she's so, so little and sweet. They're all cute, but they're all a little feisty. This one, our girl, she's just chilling. And Pix, Ovs. Ovs always the star. What's up, Pix? She's doing good too. You're doing so good. So we're just a little family in here. Just like a insane. French fries for pigs. <laughs> <laughs> so cute.